Welcome back to Unbeatable Beats TV. This is your boy, C.T. Hill. Before I get started, like, share, subscribe. Most of all, leave a comment. Now, what we got here? <laughs> Dallas blogger, Negative Ass Sean. Negative Sean exposes Benjamin Rainwater, Mo3's manager, as a broke ass nigga. He accuses that nigga of being a broke ass nigga. Negative Sean said, bet y'all didn't know it, but Rainwater broke in a bitch. And he's trying to be a blogger now. He pawned his chains too. It's still long live Mo3 though. Hashtag Negative Sean. Then he went on to say, tell him the truth, Rainwater. Why you ain't pay me? I know the facts. Then someone said, how he broke if he, if Don just signed to Empire? Negative Sean say, 500k debt. Then he says, it ain't no beef, just being honest. So Negative Sean says that Rainwater is $500,000 in debt. The thing that blows me about this whole situation, about this whole exposure, is that Negative Sean, don't get me wrong, Negative Sean is a great blogger. I'm actually a fan of his work. But Negative Sean was one of the bloggers in Dallas that, that was caping for Rainwater when everybody had their uh, skepticisms and speculations about rainwater being a snake and 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 how there are possibilities and and and, and discrepancies in his story about why people think that he set Mo3 up. So when I add certain things up, when I put two and twos together. You know, I expect things to add up correctly. So if if these certain bloggers, there's certain bloggers out here like most hated blogger, Miss Lowdown, they've been going in on rainwater. And some of the same things that these people have, have been saying, people are turning on rainwater, the Dallas bloggers, like Negative Sean. Just did a whole 360 on Rainwater when he was one of the main bloggers that used to cape for Rainwater. When people had their speculations about what happened and who was involved and who had uh, 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 who would benefit the most from Mo 3's death, he was one of the first ones, one of the first bloggers to come to Rainwater's defense. All right. Huh. I don't know if the chickens are coming home to roost or did the money go dry and people want to start to expose you then? Because that's one thing people said about, about Rainwater and the bloggers in Dallas is that Rainwater was paying the bloggers in Dallas to keep the narrative in a certain direction. All right? just to spin this shit. A lot of these bloggers like Miss Lowdown, most hated blogger, they both always said that Rainwater has something to do with Mo3 getting killed. <laughs> but with this information that was posted today by Negative Ass Sean about him being a broke nigga and then it aired out personal business that they had together, it makes you wonder, was he really paying these bloggers to spin the narrative in a different direction? And then when a certain blogger isn't paid, he's gonna tell the truth on your ass. This change the whole narrative of what's going on because Negative Sean is a very popular blogger in Dallas, very. 
even I had my speculations, but I let it go. I never said nothing. To, you know, I you know I had my speculations about rainwater, but it is what it is. I, I kind of fell back from it. But here we go again. It's a scab that we're about to reopen. And before I go, I just got a question. If so many people are saying the same thing about the same person, is it true? Because Jossie Banks said it. Most hated blogger said it. 